All right, so here we are in Blogger, and what we want to do is set our About page as our main landing page. So I'm going to take a look at my blog right now, and the way it's set up is the home page is the Blogger blog roll. So the home page is where all of my blog posts wind up. I want to set this up so that when people go to jjloomis.blogspot.com, the first page that they see is the About page, and that will always be the Landing page. Now, if you want to have your About page set as your uh, Landing page, you can also set it up in such a way that uh, you have another tab down here or something that's your uh, Blog page. Um, to do that, I'm just going to head over to Pages, and to kind of demonstrate this, uh, what you can do is right now the home page is titled Home. I can rename it Blog. Say OK, and then move it around in this, uh, this Pages area here. Now, this won't actually do uh, what we want it to do just yet. To demonstrate, here I'll go over to my site again and I'll hit the refresh button. Hit save arrangement first, and then I'll hit my refresh button. And now the uh, blog button is down here. Now the other thing is, here's my about page, here's a photography page, PDFs. You'll notice up here in the address bar, whenever I click on one of those, it gives me a little indication that that's the page I'm looking at. If I click on my header up here at the top, on most sites that takes you to your home page. So right now, if I click on it, it takes me to the blog page. So we can't have that happening um, because Usually you want your landing page to be the one that appears here in the menu if you're doing one of these sort of uh, left to right style menus. Uh, so we have to change a few other settings so that when people go directly to this link, uh, they see this page. So we're going to do something kind of nerdy right out of uh, the gate here. What we want to do is go to the page that we want to set as the landing page and we're going to select part of the URL. I'm going to click and drag up here in the address bar where it says slash p slash about.html and I'm going to copy that because what we're going to do is a redirect. Now this is some somewhat nerdy stuff but we're gonna go down to settings and under where it says search preferences underneath settings you'll see an area that says custom redirects I'm gonna click edit and in the area that says from right now the uh, current address is just my JJ Loomis stuff blogspot.com address, but I need to add a slash to that, so I'm going to type a slash and just a slash in the from field. And I'll click down here in the to field and I'm going to paste that slash p slash about.html. Uh, I'm going to paste that in there. And I'm going to click this permanent box and I'm going to click save. So what happens now is when somebody goes to uh, jjloomis.blogspot.com, it's going to redirect them to the About page. And so I'm going to go ahead and hit Save Changes. And I'll take a look at my site. We're not quite where we want to be just yet, but I'm going to hit the Refresh button. And now we'll go here to videos and let's see what happens. Let's pay attention to that uh, uh, address bar when I click on the um, header. So sure enough, it takes me to the about page and it's actually redirecting 
to the about page. It doesn't really matter that much that it essentially redirects to this location. Uh, just as an example, I'll bring up Safari, currently working in Firefox, and demonstrate if I go to jjlumis.blogspot.com uh, and hit return, it actually takes me to that about page. Now, there's still something else going on, unfortunately. If we click on blog, where does that take us? Well, blog also now takes us to the about page because blog was essentially the home page, which is now set to this. So both about and blog take us here. So we've got to fix that. So I'm going to go back over into the uh, blogger overview area, and I'm going to go down to layout. And you can see here is the uh, layout for this particular theme or template. And under the pages area, I'm going to click the edit button. Now, here are all the pages that currently appear in that uh, in my menu area. I'm, of course, going to deselect blog. And you can see it's sort of, it's in a different style, well it's in a box unlike the other pages because it's, it's essentially uh, the default home or landing page in Blogger, but I'm gonna turn it off for now. And then I'm going to hit save here, and then I'll hit save arrangement, and I'll go back up to uh, my site and hit the refresh button, blog goes away. Okay. So now I basically have a content management style website through Blogger. You know, I have my pages. I don't even have the blog role, but I can log in and uh, create content, and it's reflected here on my site. And my about page is my landing page. Now, what if we did want to include a uh, blog feature, but we don't want it the uh, central point of the site, you know, so as we saw already, if we have it just as a button down here, you know, we've, we've run into a few problems. So what do we do? How do we set this up in such a way that the blog feature is sort of less important? So I'm going to go back over here to the blogger overview area, and I'm going to go over to pages. Now, I'm going to click on New Page, and I'm going to click on Web Address. I'm going to call this new page Blog. And for the web address, I'm going to enter jjlumis.blogspot.com slash index.html and that part is very important because technically uh, the home page which in Blogger is the uh, default blog page uh, that extension for that page is actually index.html you just don't see it in well you don't see it in browsers uh, so we're going to add that in there and we're going to hit save. And now blog appears down here. And we'll click save arrangement. And we'll go back over to the site and hit the refresh button. And now when we click on blog, there it is. So we're kind of tricking blogger into uh, setting its default home page to being a less important feature on the site. doesn't really matter that much, uh, but you know, if we uh, click on videos or some other page and then click on the header, our landing page is still that about page.